For finishing this lesson on creating your own formulas and metrics on Google Looker Studio, I will show you a trick. Until now, I have shown you how to create formulas for specific charts. The problem is that you can only use this custom formula for that particular chart. I will show you how to do it from the data source. So you create this formula once and you can use it forever. I will show you what I am talking about. So I will go to my Looker Studio report and I have created this custom formula for conversion rate. So I will click on this field and first I will go to the option or I will hover in the option that it is of fx or function. And here I will see the metric and I see the formula I created, but I will display it not as a number, but as a percentage because it is, it is a conversion rate. So I will change it for a percent and I will click on apply. Now, the next thing I will do, my next trick is I don't want to copy and paste this formula all over because I will want to display my conversion rate uh, over time or in a pie chart and so on. And I am very lazy for this. So I will go to resource. I will go to manage other data sources and I will click on edit my data source where I want to have my metrics. So I will click on my Google Analytics data and in the top right corner of your, of your fields, you will see the option add a field. And on add a field, I will name my conversion rate, my conversion rate, and I will paste the formula. So this is the formula. So I, the summatory of conversions divided by the summatory of sessions. And I will save this formula and I will close uh, the option of, of data sources, this window. Now, instead of views, which is the current field I have, I will change it. I will type and I will search my conversion rate. As, as, as you can see, I can see by default this field available so I can use it in my visualization. So I will choose it and I will choose conversion rate and I am done. I will do it in another way. So I will go to add a chart and I will choose a table. And for table, again, as you can see, by default, I can display my conversion rate. So you create your formula once and you can do it forever. And you can do it because you are creating it from the data source, not from the chart. And this is another trick to calculate your formulas on Google Looker Studio.